Hey there, and welcome to Metro Connect 2023. JSA TV Live is here on location in Fort Worth. I'm sorry, Fort Worth. We are in Fort Lauderdale, <laughs> Florida, uh, coming to you live. And I have a big announcement to make. A big congratulations is in order. Congratulations to XKL <laughs> on the hire of my new friend, uh, Juliana D'Angelo. She is the Chief Financial and Administrative Officer for XKL. Congratulations Thank on, you. on your on your new role. For our viewers that don't already know, why don't you tell them a little bit about XKL? Well, um, XKL brought me in during a time of leadership transition. They are a uh, established company mm -hmm. of 30 plus years and they make optical networking equipment that is simple and reliable and easy to use. So uh, yeah, that's a, that's a quick, quick That overview. is a nice, simple, easy <laughs> yep. to understand uh, mm -hmm. description of Xscale. <laughs> Thank you very much for that. So uh, you joined um, just uh, recently. Yeah. So what brought you to Xscale? That's a, it's a great question. I, um, I came on board as a consultant mm -hmm. over the summer and I instantly fell in love with so many aspects of the company. Our leader, our founder and CEO, Len Bosak, he mm -hmm. was one of the original founders of Cisco Systems. Yeah. He has a wealth of industry knowledge and I'm constantly learning and I felt very pulled in by that. Um, our systems are reliable and they're um, established out in the industry mm -hmm. and I really, was excited to get behind a company that produces such wonderful products out there for our customers. But ultimately our leadership team is fabulous. They're some of the most collaborative and brilliant individuals I've had the pleasure of working with. And um, yeah, thank you. And yeah. so it was a no brainer at the end of the day. Uh, so were you looking to... for a new job? I wasn't, as a no, consultant? I was established as a CFO consultant. I've been doing a lot of merger and acquisition work and um, I was not looking to leave and they just pulled me in. So, yeah. <laughs> well, and, and at an interesting time, right? We're coming out of a pandemic, you might yeah. you might say, mm -hmm. um, and there were a lot of issues that might have uh, cropped up along the way with supply chain and things like that, Definitely. especially as a uh, as a uh, an equipment manufacturer and provider. Mm -hmm. uh, XKL, you guys seeing any of that supply chain issue? If so, how are you addressing that? Well, that's a great question. I. We are lucky enough to have systems available now that we can customize for customers. Mm -hmm. So uh, I think what happened is that over the last couple of years, we built up a really strategic supply of safety stock. Mm -hmm. We have been overly collaborative and communicative with our suppliers over the last couple of years. And um, through those strong relationships, we were able to mitigate as much of those, as many of those concerns as possible. And um, so now, now we are here and we're, we're positioned well. We mm -hmm. manufacture all of our equipment in the United States. So um, we don't have to deal with a lot of those extra issues. And um, one less link in the chain, so to speak. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. And every, since everything's manufactured in the USA, uh, I think we might be a little bit more of an attractive system to a lot of companies. I like out there things that are really made concerned. in the good old USA. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Sure. Um, but all in all, we're really proud of our supply chain management over the last couple of years so mm -hmm. much that our CEO is actually speaking about it at Nanog in a couple of weeks in Atlanta. So I hope everyone can catch that. Yeah, very good. Me yeah. too. Uh, next question for you. Okay, so this is one of my favorites. As the newly appointed uh, CFO at XKL, any advice that you would have for other CFOs as manage the waters right now? Because it does feel like, you know, we, we, we learned about quiet quitting and things like yep. this in, uh, you know, over the, over the last year, 18 months or so. What, what advice do you have for other CFOs? That's a good question. Definitely everything has to do with what your return on investment is going to be, whatever capital you're putting out there. Mm -hmm. um, and so whenever we make a significant investment, we're looking at all of that and a project. I think please, uh, <laughs> please do. I'm here for you right now. Go ahead. I think a lot of companies would be really happy with what they see. There's no licensing fees. We have low operating costs. Mm -hmm. um, and one of the issues I think when you're quiet quitting yeah. is employee bandwidth. Sure. And system administrators can use, set up, and maintain our products easily. So you don't need to hire optical engineers. It's almost like a set it and forget it mentality. Um, our 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 systems have optics included and we have flexible payment options available. Mm -hmm. And so generally speaking, trying to add value to our systems that we would want to find when we're trying 
trying to buy systems out there as well. So we want to make yeah. sure that we can meet our customers where they're at and just help them with their technical solutions. I love it. So uh, you are helping, uh, as you address kind of your own internal um, waters yes. as CFO, you're also helping others. Thank so uh, absolutely. So uh, for our viewers that want to learn more about XKGO. I think you should follow us on LinkedIn. Follow them up on because LinkedIn. Because we have some announcements coming up, and that's going to be the best place to Wait, you can't tell me I about those today? I can't tell you yet. So, so next time. <laughs> next time. Okay, great. Next time. Okay. Come find me. Um, they can reach out to me on LinkedIn mm -hmm. personally, and I will get them in touch with someone to help them with their solutions. And then, of course, our website, xkl.com. Out. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you, Dean. You bet. You thank you, viewers, for watching JSA TV. We will see you soon.